All right, so here's the test setup. Uh, it's not ideal, but it makes sure everything works. So I've got the DC power coming in from the bench supply, which is giving it about 20 volts at the moment. Uh, it's going into this cheap uh, ESC electronic speed controller. This is, you know, a cheap part meant for quadcopters and that sort of thing. Uh, this particular one is rated 20 amps, and uh, let's see what it says. Two to four cell LiPo, which is like eight volts, so it's running over volt, uh, 20 volts into this, which it's not really spec for. So this gets really hot and starts to degrade pretty quickly. Um, so not ideal. And then finally I've got this, which is just a, a little servo tester, uh, which emits a PWM signal, which you know drives the whole shindig. Uh, and then that obviously goes into the brushless motor itself. So not ideal for actually using, but it's what I had on hand and it should be fine for testing. Uh, in reality, this motor would like to have uh, 48 volts. Uh, so this needs to be replaced with something quite a bit beefier. Um, and then, you know, instead of using this, stick a PWM generator into like a foot puddle or something. But it works uh, for testing. I, mean, I turn it on and you know, I've got some amount of speed control depending on uh, where you set it. Uh, so yeah, I'd say this is uh, probably a, a success.